Sports. Now we've got a high octane edition of Flashback for you tonight. We're heading back to the heyday of Rowley Park when Friday night was Speedway night and you could hear it all over Adelaide. Dust, speed and fumes, it was the place where champions gathered. I mean, the people streamed into this place. Rolly Park was the place to be in Adelaide on a Friday night. It was built on the site of the old Brompton brick pit on Torrens Road and promoted by the mercurial Kim Benython. 30 feet down there was... Adelaide's first entertainment centre. Legendary Grand Prix flag waver Glenn Dix was clerk of course and says Benython ran a very tight ship. He was a tall streak of a man and I was a baby chicken type of thing and I could see his white coat coming if there was a hold up. He knew what people liked to come and see. Motorsport fans would be treated to a smorgasbord of entertainment. We had bikes running early, then they had cars running, and then the feature race bikes would run again after interval. Champion speed car driver Phil Harine started racing at Rowley Park in 1960 and says the noise was unbelievable. You could hear Speedway 20, 30 miles away. People actually put their lives on the line there, going as fast as they could get a motorbike or a car to go. Broadcaster Rob Kelvin, who was a commentator at Rolly Park, remembers watching his dad race there. You would always buy a program because as the cars came around, the bikes came around, they would throw up whatever was on the track. As they came around, you'd see everybody put the program up to stop you being sprayed. Saturday night was, you know, theatre night. So Rowley Park was just known as a place to go on Friday night. For the past 31 years, this circuit has been one of the most prestigious speedways in the country. Tonight, the shutters come down for the final time. When Rowley Park closed in 1979, it was emotional. Well, it's a very sad night, of course. The last night of one of the best tracks, I believe, in the world. This Rowley Park speedway has just been an institution in Adelaide and for all the drivers around our time. And it's a very emotional scene tonight, as you can see by the amount of people that are here. Where Rowley Park once stood is now a housing estate and reserve. This is the only reminder of where the champions once gathered. It was the entertainment centre of Adelaide. There you go. A bit before my time, I must say, Rolly Time. Yeah, great. Friday night out, didn't it? Would have been, yeah. yeah.